Warning, civil rights leaders warn a historic lawsuit could be coming over the state's rejection of a new AP African-American course. It's the latest in a saga sparked by the DeSantis administration rejecting the course over contents that it says amounts to indoctrination. Aaron Parsegian joins us live this morning. And Aaron, is there a chance that this could get resolved without a lawsuit? Yeah, the college board that oversees these AP courses, which are electives for high school students, is reviewing and revising the official framework for that course. They're going to release that on February 1st. And when they do, if the state reviews that and says it does meet their standards, there's a chance they allow that to be taught in classrooms and then they wouldn't be facing a lawsuit in the near future. Now take a look though, this has been happening over several days when the Florida Department of Education listed specific issues with sections in the initial framework, like sections on black queer studies, reparations, the Black Lives Matter movement, and activism. Now the governor's office believes the course lacks historical accuracy and has a political agenda based on that stuff. He says the DOE will reconsider the course for approval if changes are made. Civil rights groups, on the other hand, say the move further marginalizes the black community. And at a rally at the state capitol in Tallahassee Wednesday, civil rights attorney Ben Crump was joined by high school students, elected officials, and more who warned he would seek a historic lawsuit against the state and Governor DeSantis if the course is not allowed. The question really is this, brothers and sisters. Are we going to let Governor DeSantis or anybody exterminate black history from the classrooms of Florida. We say no to censorship. We say yes to community. So all eyes will be on February 1st that next week when this will framework will officially come out and that will really determine how things move forward from there. Live in Tampa, Aaron Parsegian, 10 Tampa Bay.